Hello my dear kids very good evening this is Sundar Vinayan here Hey guys what's happening how's everybody It's it's a little kind of dark right Just give me a minute guys just give me a minute Where is my Hey guys, are you able to see me? Is it okay? All right. Fine. I thought, uh, you know, the lighting is suddenly a little blur. Just wondering what is the problem. Fair? Okay guys welcome to the session it's okay we are starting a brand new chapter today a chapter on what is the kind of lifestyle all right the the bonding the interaction that people have in tropical and subtropical regions say for example you take the amazon river basin how do people live there what is their style of life right so you will see uh, a, a lot of very interesting stuff in this chapter on that note You getting me right? Human environment in tropical as well as subtropical regions. What kind of environment exists? What kind of bonding they have with nature? What kind of lifestyle they lead? Everything. Cool? Ready? Rahul, yes Rahul, I'm not uh, you know I was not well even now now I'm not fully complete, you know fine. It's raining like crazy. It's like so cold here. As a result of which, you know, I have a little cold. You can see it in my voice, right? so still recovering jashna yeah kind of feeling better thank you so much jashna okay <clears throat> so now let us start right dinesh chandra beta mera hindi bahut bahut kharab hai so aap adjust karo Video is blocked. No, it is not. I think now it is much better. Is it? All right, guys. A little word about Vinantu Young Wonder. This channel is for sixth, seventh, and eighth grade students. And what do we do? We take care of you academically as well as non-academically. Academically, if you look at it, uh, we we cover math, science, English, social, entire year syllabus. from a cbse perspective even concepts of icc also gets covered there naturally and a uh, non academically lot of series keep very interesting exciting stuff happening happen stuff like uh, space series on space series on learning coding series on careers different kind of careers okay so series on science fiction lot of stuff so please don't forget to subscribe to the channel the teachers are awesome uh, and you will simply love it okay jashna is saying sir please continue series on coding i would want to jashna i have been telling everyone so many times frankly you know part 2 requires a lot of preparation you know coding uh, i would say uh, design etc unfortunately i am not able to have that i know not having that somehow i'll figure it out guys even i would love to teach you guys uh, python and stuff let us see Oh wow Dinesh lovely Hi Aksha thank you So fun fact do you know simple I'll make the entire paragraph very simple Dolphins with respect to the intelligence they are next to they are rated next to human beings among animals They are very very intelligent they are not just the very friendly loving caring creatures they are very intelligent Okay so when you compare the ratio of uh, you know the brain to body dolphins brain and humans brain they stand next to human beings right so was this information useful for you so right after human beings dolphins take that place lovely yes okay awesome right 
let us get started human environment in the tropical and subtropical regions what are we going to cover you see those typical ghat kind of regions right so we are going to cover today life in the amazon basin everyone of us would love to learn about it right i would love to see in such a dense forest what kind of lifestyle what kind of people live there what kind of lifestyle they have number 2 the climate what kind of climate is there tropical means some climate subtropical means some kind of climate right what is it we obviously have these rain forests what are what is so special and what kind of interaction human beings have with those and people right of these uh, places these are the four things that we are going to deal with today yeah rahul all these things will come under climate the humidity part everything cool so let us start with life in the amazon basin okay you guys ready awesome here we go so amazon basin typically is in the tropics near the equator typical tropical region see guys the amazon river was discovered by a spanish explorer vincente yanes pinzon his name is vincente yanes pinzon right and uh, so remember that because that's not a, a, a discovery that you can forget right amazon the lungs of the world so lies you know it's typically in the la tropical region very close to the equator from equator if you look at it just 10 degree north and 10 degree south and needless to say the amazon river flows through the region okay guys it covers multiple countries by the way lomesh yes menti is there beta so you know there are lot of rivers which are branches of this amazon basin all these rivers go and join with the amazon basin okay so they run through look at these places brazil few places on peru bolivia equator uh, you know colombia and smart part of venezuela so it goes through all these places brazil places in peru bolivia equator colombia and again few parts of venezuela six can right so please remember all these six locations yes saksa yes we will do make tea so this is a little about amazon basin now let's look at the climate there ready yes yes just now so the amazon basin as it is in the equator it has the hot and wet type of climate typical tropical climate right both day as well as night will be hot and humid rahul was saying about humidity right very humid place yeah what is humidity guys the amount of moisture in the air you call it as humidity you will feel very you know sweaty when there is a lot of humidity cool okay so i i just spoke about it whenever there is a lot of humidity you will feel lot of sticky you know it will be sweating and sticky heavy rainfall high humidity in these regions right amazon basin you will have a lot of rainfall because so much of forests are there and uh, high humidity will be very high night time temperature goes down but still the humidity will always be there whenever you have humidity you know you will feel that stickiness hi angel welcome so guys are you clear tell this Come on give me a yo if you guys are all clear We have dealt with just a few things right So life at Amazon what is this Amazon river basin right 
how big it is who who discovered it right where all it runs through those six places as well as uh, what kind of climate lies there this is what we have dealt with till now cool cool rainforest so what are rainforests kriti this is for you so amazon basin it's typically near the equator uh spanish explorer visante yanes pinzon he is the one who discovered it right at the amazon river flows it through it lot of branches tributaries are there joining the amazon river okay it goes through six places typically brazil peru bolivia equator colombia and parts of venezuela the climate is kind of wet rainfall will be there at the same time you know hot and wet climate both hot and wet but even in the evenings when the temperature goes down still the climate will be uh, you know the moisture you know will very humid i hope you are clear now kriti right now let's go to rainforest so rainforest thick you know forest you will see amazon is like a roof you you can't see the sun peeping in at all sunlight will not reach the ground so dense so that is why the ground always remains dark and muddy damp muddy muddy okay so trees or plants and the other type of vegetation which can grow in the shade will grow there apart from the dense forest other type of vegetation only plants or vegetation which can grow in the shade because the entire thing is like a roof covered by covering the sunlight right covering uh, the entire space it's not open sunlight cannot come in so only in shade whatever vegetation can grow they only grow right but it is rich in fauna what is fauna guys what is fauna come on hey sarvagya animals yes the animal varieties and variants and species you call them as fauna the trees or the the plant uh, you know kingdom you call it as flora right so it is rich in fauna what kind of fauna <clears throat> look at it when it comes to birds you have the toucans hummingbirds the birds of bird of paradise etc living in there in the amazon animals monkeys sloths ant eating tapirs they are found okay reptiles snakes lot of guys you wouldn't believe there are a lot of species which are not even explored so crocodile snakes pythons even anaconda and boa constrictors all are huge huge reptiles that are found there and several species of fishes including the dangerous piranha fish is also found how many of you have watched the piranha movie 1 2 and 3 part part 1 part 2 part 3 anyone sarvagya done okay how about others scary right they those fish the teeth if you look at them like crazy it is they are flesh eating piranha so such dangerous species also uh, live in here clear okay guys tell this is everyone clear yeah sir bhai yeah that is true films right so they will always exaggerate a little so my dear kids tell me awesome everyone clear okay so hey guys we are almost like moving towards the, the half of the year is almost over the best time for you to help you cover the entire syllabus get all the doubts solved clarify learn everything in a simple form whatever you are not clear also clarify on them because vedantu has come out with a lovely subscription called vedantu pro these are the challenges that you any student has in general this vedantu pro is a live and interactive course covering entire syllabus so what is so special amazing teachers amazing features of the platform 
two things just two things th that will help you become a great student a great student so live online classes with these teachers they'll make real class lovable for you you will enjoy them at the same time you would have learned how will that be so entire syllabus we cover and uh, so the you know the teachers when as they teach they give you a lot of notes entire notes at the end of the session in one click you can download them so it's not like others where the teacher teaches you keep taking notes not at all required cool and doubts we make sure you ask whatever doubts you ask inside the session we solve all of them guys and more importantly we help you remember everything by registering the more assignments you write on every topic number 1 you understand number 2 you remember because you have written it written memory is like permanent you will never forget it so it helps you register it when you write the assignment as well after learning so we give you topic wise assignments and in exams you will be fearless because we help you get that exam environment by making you write more and more mock tests so mock tests the more tests you write you know you are in that exam environment you will see that when the actual exam comes the real board exam or whatever comes you become so comfortable because you know you have written it it's like just another day that's what this does the mock test do that will help you to improve on your percentage a lot as a bonus we give you thousands of topic wise chapter wise courses whatever you don't understand take that course learn it it's free so guys on the other end there is a link if you want to join there is a link blue color link pinned in your description box click on the link Note on this coupon code. It will help you get an additional discount because you are watching this class. S R P R O. Note this coupon code. S R P R O. Click on the link. Type your grade and your board. You will see this page. So you can see three types of variants. See if your requirement is sir, all I want is I want to learn from those teachers. I want tests and assignments from them. And doubts should be solved inside the class. If that's your requirement, take the first one light. If you say sir this is fine but along with all these features i also want doubts to be solved outside the class right because many times if you get doubts outside the class take up classing uh, on top of all these two both the features of light plus classing if you also want a personal mentor and a personal mentor who can guide you right throughout your journey with vedantu and you also uh, want the batch size to be only 15 people maximum take up the third. last one premium so light classic premium these are the three so you have two options my dear kids if you want to join you can try try for 15 days try for 15 days how much is it 900 rupees 15 days how much is it 900 rupees sir 900 rupees for what math physics chemistry biology english social six subjects best teachers all the features unlimited micro courses 900 rupees 15 days test it because when you test it you will know how amazing the course is all the best and uh, right to get to get to this 900 rupees click on apply coupon at the bottom here you see that at the bottom the arrow mark apply coupon type s r p r o you get the discount same applies for classic 15 days 1400 rupees premium 3000 rupees or oh, in fact 2700 post discount guys all the best make you suffer we also give you a vedantu guarantee if you take up our subscription right and you complete minimum 75% of the test that we are giving you all right and you attend 75% of our classes 75% attendance plus 75% test completion we guarantee improvement in your marks yes yes shrutika yes we guarantee improvement in your marks hey guys this offer you not have seen anywhere it is just starting so quickly pounce on it make use of it okay would love to see all of you here all right taking up the subscription all the features are simply amazing guys so in case your marks are not improving despite the 75% attendance and test completion no improvement right if you see that no questions asked take your money back cool 
all the best this is our pride pride of vedantu the students who have achieved the wall of fame with their best marks this course if you want your name as well and photograph as well to come here take this up lot of recognition is also awaiting you so once again link is there in the description box coupon code is srpro all the best guys looking forward sarvagya whatever is your performance from then it will improve obviously everyone will be performing someone will perform at 60 70 80 80 we you can expect further improvement is the point okay so sir yes i simply loved it i want to join when are the batches starting these are the dates when our batches are starting the left side you see the courses or the boards right side you see grade 6 7th and 8th hardly few classes would have just complete got completed uh, you know over the last uh, 15 20 days or so so you can always enroll even now so if you want to take a premium batches these are the dates raghav you want us to take a school so the biggest challenge is very simple raghav the the problem is if we open a school how many can we accommodate we don't want to confine ourselves to 1000 2000 3000 kids we want to try and support as many kids as possible remember we are not helping you we are supporting you become you have inherent capabilities all vedantu does its facilitate and support you give you the right directions to help you and you yourself will kick start everything this is what our teachers do as well awesome yes now coming back to human environment all right the interactions in the tropic and subtropic regions now let's speak about people in the amazon hey guys what kind of people live in the amazon and what do they do for food tell me about answer both the questions before i go atarva what is your question beta sorry i didn't see you tribals only tribals don't think so multiple tribes majority of course yes hunting that's not the only thing they do a lot of agriculture so people grow most of their food in small areas what they do is they it's it, completely it is forest they can't do anything right so they have to clear some land so they clear some trees and uh, they slash and burn those trees use it as manure do agricultural cultivation there so what do they grow you see there right now tapioca pineapple sweet potato and uh, rice food staple food as we call staple food right that is manioc it's also called cassava so apart from that they also grow cash crops like coffee maize cocoa so typically they do typical jhum kind of cultivation slash and burn the trees use them as manure do the agriculture cultivation there all right so tapioca pineapple sweet potato main main uh, source of agriculture staple food is manioc cassava which is cassava cash crops right coffee maize cocoa are also grown cool guys the rain forest it's forest right they have a lot of food lot of wood you will see them so uh, they build their houses with that wood so some families live in thatched houses typically shaped like beehives and uh, there are houses called maloka they are like apartments with slanting roofs malokas all of them are built by them themselves because of the plenty of wood is available so thatched houses shaped like beehives and the malokas so transport so if someone wants to you know access the amazon highway we have uh, i mean amazon 
in 1970 itself the trans amazon highway that made all right this entire location accessible for the world and apart from this aircraft helicopters can also be used or to reach different parts of the amazon the trans amazon highway remember this that is way back in before 50 years the indigenous population was pushed out from the area see typically you said right the tribals the indigenous population was living there they were asked to locate to other areas and big the moment human beings entered there you know what happened our guys the biological beauty of that area it starts deteriorating because we start destroying places to construct the highway to do multiple things the development activities that is spoiling the biological diversity a lot of species became extinct also ya kavya cool guys are you clear till this if you are clear we can jump into a homework and then jump into a menti all of you guys was it interesting to learn about amazon such a big big uh, you know uh, forest stretch river stretch okay and lot of uh, lovely lovely species living inside dangerous species living inside sunlight cannot peep in only shade supporting trees or vegetation can grow there all right so what kind of people live there what was their lifestyle what is the kind of climate are you clear with everything visante ns his name is all of you anvesha put your doubt beta i will answer so time for homework here it is tokens or what are they birds animals something else reptiles tokens manioc is the staple food of what and dash lies between 10 degree north and 10 degree south so this is the homework for all of you quickly try and figure out the answer first three people to answer i will take your names tomorrow ready cool awesome now time for a menti here it is tishku Eight triple five five two three eight. Medicates. Go to the website menti dot com. Open our browser. Go to this website and type the code eight triple five five two three eight. Eight five 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 two three eight. Eight five 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 two three eight. Come on come on come on faster open your browser window separately type www.menti.com and type this code 8555238 guys jumping into a menti now here we go 5555 who is that lomesh it's you okay here it is Guys, I could not see a lot of you. Quick, 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 quick! Join fast. There are only five questions. First question will hit your screens in the next fifteen seconds. 
हाय कल्पना हाय अभिनव हे लोमेश दैट्स ओके यार आई नो यू जोकिंग Kriti, tell sir, tell your Insta ID, please. I'm very poor in with Instagram, Kriti. Frankly, I'll do one thing. Tomorrow I'll let you know. Ping me tomorrow in the session. I'll let you know. I don't remember, frankly. I don't use Instagram much. Guys, I do not know. Uh, I don't use Facebook, Instagram, and all much. Okay, see Sri Radha. Sri Radha river's mouth is the place where the river meets the sea or the ocean. It mixes, right? That is what you call as the river's mouth. Clear? The the area where of the river, the 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 you know, which where exactly the river goes and mixes with the uh, the larger water body, ocean or the sea. You call it as a river's mouth. Okay. Cool. Atarva, was that a uh, what do you call a sarcastic comment? Because I didn't even shave today. <laughs> Because I was not well, right? Okay, guys, time up. Let's jump in. Here we go. First question. Hitting your screens. Ready, ready, ready. Here we go. First one on your screens now. Out of the five, first question. Here it is. How is the climate of Amazon being, you know, basin characterized? Cold and wet, hot and wet, dry and wet. None of these. Cold and wet, hot and wet, dry or wet. None of these. Simple, right? Pretty simple, frankly speaking. So, guys, how many of you chose the option B, which is hot and wet? I'm sure most of you. Guys, who said it is cold and wet here? Both are almost same, right? Hot, tropical. That means hot will by default come. Hot storm, Diksha, Bigyan, Sushravya, and Sagar. Top five: Swabiman, Kanishka, Sarvagya, Bear, and Sebastian. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Question number two. Here it is. At night, the temperature goes down in the Amazon basin, but the humidity, what happens to it? Remains the same. Remains very low. Remains high. None of these. At night, in the Amazon basin, the temperature becomes it goes down. What happens to humidity? Hi, Sebastian Neil. Hi, welcome back. Hi, Sushravya. Thank you. So option A, guys, how ca or remains high you have put? Very nice, very nice. So, uh, I wouldn't blame you guys if you have put remains blessed. Same, but remember, in the night time also the humidity will still be high. That's the right answer. Exact answer is remains high. So day time how it is? Whether the humidity is fluctuating in the night time also, he, you know, humidity will be high. So two questions done. Visa, Diksha, Sagar, Sebastian. Abhinav, top five. Chinmoyi, Lomesh, Holaha, Puffy, and Snehit. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Question three. Here it is on your screens. So the forests are in fact so thick that the dense roof is created by 
so the forest of the amazon it is so dense all right it is created because of what cement concrete the leaves or the stones what makes that forest look like a roof ayush don't mock at me like this here i'll start crying <laughs> Kriti, you have to be careful, right? Why did you misclick? So 50, most of you, almost everyone, guys, the leaves are so dense that it, you know, makes the forest appear like a roof. Sunlight cannot peep in. So after three questions, Pisa at the top, followed by Diksha, Sagar, Lomaya, Sri Radha. Top five. Strehit, Sebastian, Chinmoy, Ryan, Renjani. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Question four. Guys, buckle up, all of you. There is one more, just one more. Fourth one on your screens now. So the Amazon basin <laughs> is in North Africa, South America, North America, South Africa. Wow, this is a good question. Hi Mukund. So guys, you tell me, what is it? I Mukun. So where is it? How many of you say North America? How many of you say North Africa? Wow. Not bad. South America. That's where it originates. It runs across places, you know that, right? So, four questions are done. Looks like Sagar is topping up now. Sagar, Renjani, Chinmoy, Sri Radha, Ananya, top 5. Pisa, Diksha, Sushravya, Sarvagya, Swabhiman. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Hey guys, the final tamale, the decider getting onto your screens now. <coughs> Thank you, Ayush. The Amazon Basin is the largest river basin in the America, World, Africa, Australia. Guys, if you know English, you can answer this question. Even if you have not listened, in case you have missed it. If you know English, you can answer this. You know why? Any idea why? Why did I say if you know English you can answer this? Come on, come on, someone figure it out, find it out. Exactly Nimesh. Right? The last word of the question is the. <coughs> T-H-E-D. D means you cannot put a country there. Alright, so in the America, in the Africa, in the Australia, you can't. In the world is the right answer, by the way. Wow, wow, wow. So most of you got this right, by the way. That is like my rockstar kids. So, who's winning? Looks like Sagar, guys. Ranjini, Chinmoy, wow, wow. Sagar, congratulations, beta. Great job done. Ranjini, Chinmoy, Sri Radha, Pizza. Top 5. Amazing. Sarvagya, Diksha, Ayo, Swabhiman, Snehit, every one of you. Kudos to all of you guys. Lovely job done. Hey guys, did you like the session? Did you enjoy it? Live in the Amazon. Live in the tropics. What kind of climate exists there? Right? I showed you multiple pictures of the Amazon also. So, if you want to reach Amazon, you have the Trans Amazon Highway. Which you can pick. Helicopters, air charter crafts are also there. To reach so i if you like the session do not forget to hit the like button now and by the way guys we have a lovely uh you know telegram group where thousands of kids are already there so to join our telegram group of vedantu young wonders type t.me slash vedantu junior in your address bar i repeat t.me slash vedantu junior Okay, 
and don't forget to make use of the subscription guys because uh, uh, this price you will never get anywhere and even we have not given earlier 900 rupees 6 subjects my god it's crazy go for it immediately the coupon code is SRPRO the link is there right there in the blue color description you know the comment box blue color link which is pasted there all the best guys looking forward hit the like button and do share the video to your friends and don't forget to subscribe to the channel thank you so much lovely meeting all of you so what we will meet you or i will meet you tomorrow same time until then this is myself sundar ravindranathan signing off kids bye bye have a lovely lovely evening